it's Proud Cat Lover, and I'm going to say real quick because I normally always get hate comments on any of my insect videos. So I'm going to say this part real quick before I show you what's in this container. Um, these insects are caught for study and collection, and I do entomology, which is the collecting and studying of insects. I do not catch a whole bunch of one kind, I catch one of each gender. Um, so male and female, and then the rest, if I ever find them, I normally don't catch them. And if I raise them, then I release them, I don't keep them. So I'm going to say real quick, the only reason I have this one is because one, I don't have it in my collection, and two, silk moths are not born with mouth parts when they turn into a moth. So once they pupate from the caterpillar to the moth, they no longer can eat. They have two weeks to find a mate, lay the eggs, and die. So this is a male and uh, he already was pretty weak when we found him and like I just said he can't eat so he's pretty much starving to death so after saying this I will show you this is a male luna moth gorgeous gorgeous silk moth sadly one of his tails is missing but the way to tell it's a male is the antennas are real feathery um but this is what luna moths look like just from my hand kind of gives you an idea He's about three inches long. Wingspan is probably about like four and a half to five inches. But yeah, Luna moths are very uncommon to find in town. And I live in town, so I was kind of surprised that my dad found him. But yeah, so he's going to make a really nice addition to my collection. He's the second silk moth species I have aside from polythemus moths. And polythemus moths get a little bit bigger than Lunas. But uh, still just as beautiful. But yeah, the Luna moths are gorgeous. And they normally only come out at night. So that's why I was kind of surprised my dad found one. And normally they hang out in the country, um, in trees. Because normally the trees that their caterpillars eat on are only found most of the time out in the country. Unless you specifically plant those kinds of trees to attract them. But uh, yeah, so I thought I'd show you guys because he's really gorgeous. Anyway guys, thank you for watching and have a good day.